Hi, we finally reached our first destination in Otaki Gorge, at Steve and Jenny's place. Uh, getting here, we got soaked. Pretty much everything got soaked. But um, at least we've got a dry place to get everything dry again. Let's cook in some veggies, some hot veggies for our lunch. Um, this is Steve and Jenny's beautiful yurt. Yeah. They're all out at the moment. They do a course in uh, Wellington on a Wednesday. And Ooh, that rain. There's a little playhousey thing over there, I think. That's what that is. And a chicken sheltering under it. Got the kitchen here. And you're gonna veggie. A toilet back there. Collecting heaps of water, big veggie gardens over yonder, a shed and a water tank down there, and there's lots of bush. And if you go through these trees, you get to the Otaki River, which is looking pretty um, fast at the moment. Here we are, we're just going to chill out, have some kai, and um, oh yeah. See a little caravan in the distance there, poking up the heat team, the trees. That's where we're going to be staying for the next few weeks. So I'll put my side to sleep there, pretty soon. About 2 o'clock, there is due one. And then, um, try to get everything dry, try to get the cells dry. My shorts are soaked, unfortunately, I only own one pair of, oh, I've only got one pair of shorts with me. So, I've just got to wear them until they're dry. Tomorrow we'll go into town and then, Buy heaps of food and uh, some supplies, maybe a saucepan and some um, trousers. So we're going to try and keep as dry as we can. Nice to be here finally, I suspect it's been 500 kilometres. I saw the bike man today as well, getting myself a nice new seat and um, changing the brake pads over. Get it all service and uh, polish for the South Island. But um, it'll be nice to hang out here once the rain stops for a good few weeks. My Maka is having quite a bit of fun. We've got a few toys here. Yeah. Oh, good. Fireplace. The plan is I'm going to give these guys some hot water, hopefully solar and wet back hot water, uh, in return for of staying here and, and learning some of their wisdom, uh, and these around wild foods, edible weeds and such, so stay tuned.